we want to bridge that gap where party politics have been separating our people and a lot of women do not pick up the challenge to, to want to lead and from what I am seeing attending these forums have made me more energized and enthusiastic to, to just go out and champion the cause to other women that they should get up and let us let our voices be heard. Politics is a nasty game and women do not want to enter to a great extent because of that. Uh, you have to have um, thick skin, they say, you know. As you see right now, the, the People's United Party, uh, they have 14 uh, era representatives in office. Uh, our party has 17. By right, with a proportional representation, the People's United Party would have a, a proportional say. All right, they would have, I don't know, my, my math, I don't know, around a little over, around 30, at 40 percent say they would have. As it is right now, however, however, they have no say. I mean, really, do you want to change that? Yes, yes, I think that is wrong. I mean, one day it could be my party in, or, or VIP or whatever, and it would be wrong just the same. All those people who voted for them should have adequate representation but as it is right now there's no even though they may try to do their thing in their constituency they don't have they don't have any backative really when it comes to going into parliament because that's just how the system is it's not proportional representation it's first past the post and um that needs to change mess up is the area you're looking, you have your eyes on it um, yeah, I mean, um, when it comes to the Mesopotamia division, I, I, have, um, I have done work in that area, and I believe that um, in terms of, you know, being able to adequately represent